Welcome to Overthinking TV Interviews Streamers. I'm Jay. And I'm Tony. And do we just love talking to people? We do. We got so bored talking to each other, we thought, we need to talk to other people. Yeah, you're pretty boring now. Plus, it was getting really weird. People oh, were having questions. Don't ask questions. Yeah, don't do that. Mm -hmm. um, <laughs> he's happily married and we're fine. So, with... <laughs> Anyways, today on Interviewing Streamers, uh, we, we have a great, oh my gosh, a great person with us today. He's great. It, when we first saw this guy streaming, I was like, yo, we got to get him in an interview. Mm -hmm. he's, he's, he's loving, he's caring. He oh, yes. is Big Sin. Big Sin. What's up, dude? Hey, man. Hey, oh. guys. How you doing? Thank you for having me. <sighs> dude, it's great to have you, man. Like you're, I mean, we, well, we first, I first saw him on TikTok. TikTok, yep. So, um, so we found you. I, I found you on TikTok, and not gonna lie, like you can see it right now. If you're on our YouTube video right now, if you're just listening to the podcast and Spotify and all those, if you're watching our YouTube video, you can see his display and stuff. I noticed right away the colors, the 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 warm feeling to the video, and just how your your um, was it the the overlays really awesome too. I remember seeing you, and then but TikTok grabbed my eye. Did it grab yeah. your eye? Oh, grab grab my eye. Yeah, just plucked it right out. It did. Um, but when you, we saw you on TikTok, but what was your first instinct of us when we were asking you to like, to get interviewed? What did that, was that weird or <laughs> like, uh, so, so for me, it wasn't, it wasn't super weird. Um, as you guys know, I, I used to play professional counter-strike back in the day. So I, this is Ooh. not new to me. Um, but it's new, like in recent past, I retired in like 2009. So, um, wow. cool to get back in the spotlight a little bit, I guess you could say. Right. That's I remember right. playing Counter Strike. So, have you ever done an interview before? Like, have you ever done something like this before? He just said he did. Do it. I'm not sorry. A, not about I say streaming. That? Not but about I'm, streaming. This not, is the first time about streaming. That's so. right. Because I talked to you about that before. That's why I was like, I know you did interviews on something else, but like streaming, this right. is your first. And listen, man, I don't. It's not going to be your last, bro. I think pe more people should get to know you. I think more people need to find out about you. Um, the way you just I what is it called? That. Well, I'm super intrigued about the Counter Strike. Like, how how ranked were you? Uh, well, like Counter Strike was very different back then. So this is like before CS:GO was even a thing. I've yeah. never even played CS:GO. Oh, so, I played CS:GO. Not as good. <laughs> um, so so back in the day, they had big tournaments. Like you know, the league was called Cal, um, and there was several different divisions. Um, Cal Invite was the the highest. The pro teams. I think there was like maybe twenty teams at the time. Um, I played there for about three years, um, and then there was a. The, one big tournament and that was called uh cpl and that was where they would invite like 64 teams from all over the world um and the highest i ever placed was eighth but Jeez. like like that's it was a big deal back then it was a big deal back then so i was actually a really big counter-strike you were player yeah. back in the day i used to um this will this will date me a little bit they had the internet cafes that popped up yeah. the gaming cafes i remember those yep. 100%. and we had one in my town and they were it was owned by this really cool couple and they had the gaming computers with CS going and they would have tournaments where they'd have 24 hour like they you could pay 20 bucks and you would stay there for 24 hours and you play tournaments all day and we played counter strike i won cool. every single one of my counter strike ones but uh never went anywhere from it cuz i didn't own a computer i was you know, yeah. not the kind of kid that did that so it's a console yeah, actually kid. my my first pro team was called gamewise and that was a land center that sounds uh, familiar that's kind of yeah it was, it was in, yeah. I don't know where you guys were at, but it was in Texas at the time. So, hmm. And I know the information highway wasn't as crazy back then, so we probably wouldn't right. have heard about it as much. But Exactly. Um, exactly. I remember those cafes. Dude, that's where like people, this is what Tony and I really like to go out to these Super Smash tournaments. By the oh, way, yeah. he's like a, he's so good at, Tony's really? like amazing at. I'm terrible at it. Me too. I'm, <laughs> I'm good at video games just in general. Dude, I can, I can main Kirby all day that's all i do like i just float and i drop the rock that's all i do i got nothing <laughs> that's very annoying i got nothing in smash <laughs> uh, you could probably beat me that's how bad i am i'm it's okay um but we used to go to the smash tournaments and we had this really cool idea about and we just haven't been able to do it just because of what's been going on with you know yeah people that haven't been having tournaments in our area right we oh went, really well yeah. the number one in the world super smash player lives in our town so, oh wow! Yeah, that's incredible. Yeah. So he go he. Uh, I remember GameStop had the grand release of the newest Super Smash Bros. game, and they they had a tournament. And if you won the tournament, I think you got your game for free. And he oh, showed wow, that's up super cool. and just wiped the floor. <laughs> and they were all just so impressed to even see him. They were just like, 
I don't care that I just got destroyed. <laughs> I got to meet him. Who did he main again? I don't remember who he mained. He was Star, Star Fox. Or Probably Fox. Fox. Knock it off, Fox. Knock it off, Fox. <laughs> <laughs> do you remember Star Fox, Big Zen? I do remember Star oh Fox. Oh my yes. gosh, dude. Yes. I don't know why Slippy was my favorite. Oh, it's, never mind. What? I mean, was it Slippy? It's Slippy, right? <laughs> What's her name? What's the frog's name? Slippy. Stop is it, talking. I think, is I think it? you're right. I'm you're right. right. I know. I know you're right. I just you just don't want me to say Slippy anymore. I just want you to stop saying Slippy. <laughs> <laughs> um, but yeah, man, we know we saw uh, it, a lot of those things. You said you're really big in, in you know dropped out 2009, but streaming and it is like it's an. Inv- I know, like you know, it's an investment in it more is. ways than one. And I don't know if you, if you just can like, and I feel like you would know a lot how to talk about this. Uh, what's the investment in, in streaming? Like f- even financially or just worth your time? Like what, what would you like tell other streamers that are building right now and like trying to stream? What's the investment? Oh, it's it's huge. It's huge. So I started streaming in 2016. So it's been a long time, but I never took it seriously. I never invested the time uh, until recently. And that's kind of why like I, you know, I never went anywhere with streaming because I just did it for fun, played with my friends and that was it. Right. Um, so recently I invested, started investing the money into the stream, you know, the camera, the overlays, the logos, all that stuff. Right. And actually investing the time in growing a community. And, and that's kind of where it's starting to take off. So um, I always tell like, I, so my community is built around like helping other small content creators start and, and get their start and understand this. So what I tell them is like, start wherever you can. You don't have to invest a ton of money right away you know, start building your audience, start building your brand. Right. And, you know, as you start making money, put it back into your stream. I mean, as long as you're putting money into your stream, eventually you'll get your content where you want it. So, right. yeah. It's difficult with the times with, you know, having to yeah, work absolutely. full time. Just you got a family. I mean, I, that's my struggle is, uh, I mean, we're a two man team. So if one of us is not busy, the other one can do the stream. Mm-hmm. That's right. what keeps our content going. But with me, I'm like, there was a period of our time where I had to work all the time. So yeah. he just streamed all the time. And I was, every once in a while, I'd show up and everybody was like, oh, Tony's like the, he just is guest star. <laughs> and I'm like, no, I, no. I started this stream. It's just, we, we're together. We've been doing this this whole time. And together. I and I mentioned it all the time. I'm like, you know, Tony's here. And then when we weren't able to do like couch games as much, all these different things, it kind of, believe it or not, as much as I feel like I would like to say like, well, I'm getting better at streaming and stuff it's not the same it's not the same because you you know you work off of each other and like yeah. being a solo streamer you, has your wife cuz your wife helps you stream or she like co like does she on there sometimes she is not on the stream um very often but um she's just like the the, the hype woman like she's in everyone's yeah, she chat in my community just hyping everybody she's up. so good at it um yeah she yeah she 100 keeps the chat moving for me when i'm like focusing on a game or whatever right. so it's it really is a team it, it like that's it, a it'd team, be hard yeah. to do by myself wow. to be honest wow you see that's 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 a wife right there yep. that's all. you married your wife does it whenever she can she watches when she can but she's got the kids so the team effort there is take care of the children <laughs> and keep the house running while i'm playing video there games you in the garage you know <laughs> sounds so sad <laughs> Just gonna go lay down. I'm gonna take care of the kids. You play your little video games in the garage with your air conditioner. (laughs) (laughs) It's 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 not sad. (laughs) It's great. So true. He's working on. It's actually he's turning his whole garage into like a street. It's really cool. It's actually pretty. That's awesome. awesome. Yeah. Uh, I need to get some LED strips. Twenty bucks Amazon. Twenty. Twenty bucks Amazon. (laughs) Yeah, that's changes everything. I mean, look at that. I know. Connects it connects to Alexa and everything. Oh, you know, it's yeah. awesome. What kind of? You know, I use Google. That connects to mm-hmm. that too. Oh, okay, cool. Um, while we're here, because I had a lot of questions, even just while we were watching your stream. Sometimes Tony and I would just sit on the couch here. We have you on the big screen. So we'll watch you. And we're just watching you. You know, we're just like we do that with streamers. We just like we put it on, just kind of watch. And we're like, well, that's pretty cool what they did there. And what kind of mic are you using? It was one the, one of the questions I. Uh, this one is an AKG P220 is the name. Um, I got it several years ago right when it first came out. It's actually not too expensive anymore. You can get like the mic, the shock mount, and the um, arm all for like 200 bucks. Damn. Um, but it is it is an XLR mic, that so you have to get an XLR. interface. Yeah. Yeah. You have to get an interface. So. He's, yeah, he's got an interface. Yeah, the interface. And everything. Yeah. That's really cool, man. And now, I mean, all that, and we love the displays and the, and the actual, you know, equipment. But I think there's stuff that goes with the Discord. You have stuff going on with your Discord yeah. currently. I do, yeah. So I, I started the Discord basically as just a 
a place for all the small streamers to come and connect and um, kind of help people get to affiliate, you know, network with people. And it's, it's really taken off. I mean, we're, I think we're nearing like 850 members in the discord wow. and we started at maybe, maybe a month and a half ago, something mm, like wow. that. Wow. Um, so it's really, it's really blowing up. People are awesome. Uh, it, it's been incredible. Would you say like how, it, because we know, but I think it's the importance of how essential a discord is. It what? is huge. Yeah. It is huge. Um, you don't have to do what I'm doing, but it is nice to have a place like for you to interact with your viewers outside of the stream. Mm -hmm. I think it helps build that relationship and makes them, you know, kind of gets them to want to come back. So, right. I'm seeing a trend amongst all the people we interview. <laughs> not that not discords. Discord. <laughs> they all do have discords, but separately, they all they're so connected to their communities. Yeah. Separately, separate from their Twitch. So that's why their Twitch is blowing up. Their yep. stream is blowing up 100%. because the Discord, the TikTok, the community outreach separately. The investment. That's in yeah. It's investing your time with other people. I mean, you have to sit there on your phone and just like message, message. You go through different things. It's, it is a lot of time and effort. I mean, yeah, it is. You don't it think is. And like our it. Discord's growing so fast that it, I mean, it's, it's hard for me to keep up with everybody. But that's where like like the community has just become so awesome that they all support each other. Mm -hmm. And like, no one's like, Hey, where's, you know, where's big sin. Like they're all just, you know, doing it on their own at this point. So like the discord is growing organically without me even like inviting people at this point. Right. So it's, it's just become like a really cool family. Like, and, and I love it. I'm, yeah. I'm really enjoying it. Yeah. I, I heard you have a graphic designer on call. We do. We do. Yeah. Um, a streamer, uh, his name is the Panda Nate Ooh. and it's N8. Ooh. Um, and, and then the number eight, um, oh. he, he found me on TikTok and he was like, Hey, you know, I really love what you're doing. I want to offer my services free to anyone in your community. He will make you a logo, your channel branding, you know, three emotes for absolutely free of cost. Whew, um, wow. which is, it, it's incredible. He's super busy. I mean, yeah. Oh yeah. Yeah. He's got a long line, but he, he does really well keeping up with it too. I mean, he, he knocks out two, three, four orders a day sometimes. So wow. And it's quality Jeez. stuff too. It's like really like he's a really talented designer. Yeah, we've seen like a lot of this stuff. I'm just like, wow, that's really yeah, awesome. That's awesome. Man, it's just yeah, like, he's just a great wow. dude. I'm like, can I can I pay you like you know a little bit like to help you? He's like, no, I won't take it. Like the only way you can give the man money is like you go to his uh, like his stream and donate subs to him because he won't take your money. So hey, pa <laughs> hey Panda and and eight, um, <laughs> we don't we don't want to pay you either. I'm, <laughs> like, <laughs> I'm just kidding. It's messed up. No, I'm kidding. I'm kidding. That's awesome. You know, and it's great that you have people support you and yeah, um, you know, that's and I th I think it's a really awesome thing. And you're you're right. Like we were talking about the Discord, but I want to talk about the TikTok for a second. Mm. So when did okay. you start making? It TikToks and where's your followers at now? We haven't. And what, it, how did you blow up so quick? And what did you do? I don't even know. I don't. I, I don't even know. I, I've made. It's probably been two months since I started. Since I downloaded Jesus. TikTok, it's probably been two months. Two months. Um. Yeah, I'm probably gonna hit three thousand followers by tonight or tomorrow. Or shadow band. <laughs> <laughs> Tony and I are convinced that we are shadow banned. Um, you said it on your stream recently when I was talking to you. I said, we're almost at 500 followers. And you're like, what? <laughs> <laughs> this, I don't know. Yeah, I mean, it's okay. I mean, we, we, we don't really like, we're not like, we want your followers. We're just like, we're like, what are you We want to know the secret sauce. Can we just, you know, but I so, think, yeah, go ahead. I want to hear more about that. So when I first started, um, it was, it was genuine interaction and encouraging people to like and comment because I'm not exactly sure how the algorithm works, but in my mind, the more interactions you get with a video, the more people are going to see it. And that's seeming like to what has blown it up. So once I got to a thousand, then I stopped doing that because I already had enough people that I could, you know, get enough people to see it and get it on the algorithm. That's right. when I started creating like the cool, funnier, you know, content that people like. Um, but encouraging people to like, you know, drop your Twitch, you know, like yeah. this video, share it with a friend. That kind of thing is what helped me. Right. Yeah, no, I did all this research into the algorithm. I'm I the tried al too. I'm the algorithm king over here. I'm like, it's 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 time watched plus likes plus comments, right. and then if the video is shorter, they watch. And, I, and we just ha I've right. sat there and done all the math, and it's just like we he's put like out a crazy one. scientist. We put out one, and I'm like, this hits every mark. It should work. I put it out. Okay, so nothing. So here's a, here's a, here's a secret, right? Oh, so. What I do is I will let my TikTok run for 24 hours. 
And then I will go back to that TikTok, and that's I, I comment to almost every single person. I you know I say, hey, come to the Discord. You know, you're you're a small streamer, come to our Discord. And when I'm commenting on 300 different TikTok or 300 different comments, you know, some I try to like not give the same comment to every person, but hmm. when I when I do 300, it seems to hit the algorithm a second time, and I'll get another wave of you know another three, boost. four, five thousand views. We just have to encourage people to comment. So, you're hearing it here, people, right here yeah, on right our here. podcast. That's my right? that's my trick. That's my trick. And it's lately, out. and lately, it seemed to even help more because Scarlet and Eclipse, the other founder of my community, they have gone through my TikToks and they started commenting, inviting people to the Discord instead of me. Man, and that seems to help also. So. Must be nice to have mods that do stuff. No, you don't. It's hey, a- <laughs> hey! Shout out to incredible. our mods that actually do some stuff, guys. <laughs> Golly. Dude, we're going to un- have unsubscribe. Oh, they're unsubscribing right now. It's fine. No wonder why the algorithm doesn't work. <laughs> <laughs> we know our, our mods are terrible. <laughs> <laughs> no, but that's, that's really Joke, great, man. I love them. Yeah. My favorite, I'm, and I just got to say, my favorite TikTok so far, Big Sin, is the twerking. <laughs> That was my favorite, dude. I'm like, I hit, can I just no 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 weirdness? I hit like right away. <laughs> I was like, this is amazing, dude. I, I that's hit something it. I never thought I would do in my life. I'm not gonna lie, but ten dollars is ten dollars. So, <laughs> <laughs> oh my gosh! Woo! And I like. I'm sweating over here. I like the one who donated that for the first. Yes. That was your wife. Yeah, we watched. Yeah, it. that was no, Scarlett. Knew that was. <laughs> She's like, oh yeah, baby. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, <laughs> um, so that was getting that was our banter. Getting to know you are some questions. Um, so we're gonna go on to our next one, which is uh, going to be lightning round. All right, everybody. Uh, getting to know Big Sin. That was great questions. Uh, we're getting to know even TikTok algorithm. <laughs> uh, but we're gonna do lightning round. Zip it, zap, zip, 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 zap, zip. All right. Zip. Okay. It's okay. Uh, sorry. I had some caffeine. So we're going to do lightning round. Big Sin, how this works is how do we get to know somebody, but we get to know them through lightning round. Now, I'm going to ask you a series of questions, okay? Answer as fast as you can. It's okay. As as best you can. Anything that comes to the top of your head. And we're going to go over your answers afterwards and see the reasons why. Is it, are you ready? I'm ready. Okay. So here we go. <clears throat> <clears throat> throat> okay. Okay. All right. Lightning round begins in three, two, one. One favorite candy to eat while at the movies. M and M's. Ooh, okay. Favorite zoo animal. Ooh, lion. Ooh, okay. Roar. If you could, <laughs> roar. If, if you could spend the day with any Marvel Avenger, which Avenger would you choose? One hundred percent Iron Man. Nice, Tony Stark. Good answer. Uh, if you could have any superpower, what would you have? Ooh, the ability to fly. Okay, everybody. I love it. Me too. I know. Okay. What's your favorite color? Blue. Okay. Oh. Uh, favorite fast food French fries? McDonald's, I think. Good answer. That's a good answer. Yeah. Domino's, Pizza Hut, or Papa John's? Pizza Hut, and it's not even close. I love you. I love you. Oh, my God, Tony. Oh, my God. That's lightning round. Good job, Big Sin. We've had this thing about... Pizza Hut's my Can you wait till we get to the question? That's it. Can I just... This is important to me. I know it is. This is important. We'll get to that. Okay. Yeah, thank so, you. <laughs> let's go over the first one. I can't wait for the last one. Okay. Golly. Favorite candy to eat while it's movies? You said M&M's? Yep. It's a solid peanut choice. M&Ms. I mean, it is. Are you... Specific. Not peanut M&M's, just regular. Yeah, peanut M&M's. He said peanut no, M&M's. Peanut. 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 Oh, yeah. you said peanut. No, he said M&M's, but peanut M&M's are specific. Oh, I was so, specific. I'm sorry. I was so like in the zone asking questions. Got it. Yeah. Favorite zoo animal. You said lion? It's actually probably a tiger, but lion was the first thing I thought of. That's so. fine. I, you can. Lions are majestic. Kind of, yeah. Tigers are just as majestic. Different way. Hmm. I, right. I actually have been this close to a tiger before. I worked at a zoo really? for a little while as a photographer. If you're listening on the podcast, oh, that'd be incredible. Him. Yeah, right up. I was like right there next to him taking pictures for a group. It was no great. Way. Yeah, I, I almost that'd got to incredible. feed him, but they uh, they said it was time to go because he was getting upset. <laughs> yeah, I'm the uh, tiger was me. <laughs> Sorry. <laughs> Zing! All right, here we go. Golly. <laughs> if you could spend the day with any Marvel Avenger, who would you choose? You said Tony Stark, Iron Man. An Absolutely. Answer. 100%. And, yeah. and he re- I mean, we already kind of know the reasons, but what's your reasoning? Like, why would you he's just He's just my, my favorite Avenger of all time. The dude is so smart, like, and 
I just look up to him. I don't know. He's such a smart know. Alec, too. He is. Love He's it. hilarious, right? God, I, mean, I base my life off of him. I mean, I just want to fly in the in the suit. Me to too, honest. man. I want to be in that Hulk buster and see what it feels oh, like. Like yeah. I don't know. Maybe they make a fat guy version. I'm not sure, but they better, dude, because <laughs> I'm having a baby. Do you have an XL <laughs> Iron Man suit? Because yeah, right. I know I'm not going to go Mach Five. I'll go Mach though. <laughs> um, <laughs> I'm sorry. If you could have any superpower, you said you would fly. I would. I would. I in. It's not even just like me being able to fly. Like aviation has just like been a huge part of my life. So anything in the air is super cool to me. So wait a minute, aviation. What do you mean? Like, how's it been a big part, big part of your life? I'm a I'm an Air Force veteran. So what? Um, yeah, Whoa. yeah, dude. What? Actually, um, my first my my first love was like airplanes. Like growing up, I loved going and watching them take off and land uh, with my grandpa. Oh, and then wow. I joined the Air Force because he was in the Air Force and. Um, I even went to college for aviation sciences, and I don't do anything with it. But Whoa. You know, I did. I did do that. That's tough, dude. Did you? Yeah. Did you fly? I didn't. I didn't. I was a mechanic actually in the Air Force. Oh man. Yeah. Nice. Everybody, we're going to uh, let's let's raise some money right now. <laughs> we're going <laughs> to raise his, him up. Let's get fly. his license, everybody, <laughs> and then there he's going to fly us. Yeah. Oh my gosh. I've jumped out of yeah. a plane. I've he's done jumped sky, out of skydiving, but that's about as I'm so, like. And here's the weird thing, right? I'm I'm like absolutely terrified of heights. Oh, I love but like, heights. But like being in an airplane is okay. But like jumping out of one, yeah, probably not. It's really like just like jumping into a painting. Stop. It really is. I love. I just love it. Wow. That's, he wants me to go, and I don't want to go. So you use a you use a veteran. That's, yeah. You, I am. Th- thank you for you know for right, doing sure. that, man. We appreciate you. Um, just wanted to say that. We, that's, look, we I would never know that. It's awesome. Yeah, you're really cool. He's cooler than me. So cool. Ugh, there comes a tear. I knew he was cooler than me. That wasn't a question. Yeah, that's how we already knew that. <laughs> yeah. Um, favorite color? You said blue. Blue, yep. Um, big University of Michigan fan. I grew up in Michigan. Oh. Uh, so, you know, nice. go blue is just our thing. Go blue! Yeah. Go blue. Yeah. Wow. I'm a Giants fan, so I no. bleed blue. So There you go. Good. Not doing too great go. today, huh? We lost, yeah. But it's okay. It's not the team. We're not going to get a single touchdown. So okay, okay, we got some field goals. Okay, okay. <laughs> I know our team's not very good right now. They're going to at me a lot. Oh, okay. Yeah. Uh, favorite fast food French fries? You said McDonald's. That's a great answer. Yeah, Mc- McDonald's is delicious. My favorite like type of fries is crinkle cuts. So like mm-hmm. you know you can go to like Del Taco or anywhere that has crinkle cuts. I have this I mean, question. Like, so McDonald's, is there a time limit on w- how quickly you could like? If they go past like a certain amount of time, you can't eat them anymore. No, you can always eat them. I can always eat them. Me too. I'll even warm them up in the microwave. They're not near as good, but they're not. But big scent. You are my. You're my spirit guy. Yeah, I'm telling you, legitimately, (laughs) everything that I hate. You guys love together <laughs> because, like, of course, like I want to eat the fries hot. Of right, I eat them. Of course. If, if it goes past absolutely. ten minutes, I stop. I ten can't. minutes, I throw them out. dude. I can oh, like. Yeah, no, I'm in. Twenty. I'm in. Twenty years are still beginning. Stop. <laughs> yeah. I mean, that's the thing. If like they've been saying, like, oh darn. Well, it's McDonald's, so nothing nope. ever ages. So nope. yeah, I'm, in. I'm um, in. Can I ask you before we go past this? What's your second favorite fast food French fry? I'll oh. tell you, it's not Wendy's. Okay. It's um, not Wendy's. Okay. I don't know, probably Chick-fil-A. Yeah. Yes. There you go. Yeah, I can agree on that one, too. Yeah. What do you what do you dip them in? Do you dip them in anything? Chick-fil-A Chick-fil-A sauce. Always. Oh. No what? Chick-fil-A sauce? I, I'm really weird. I, I'm probably the only person on the planet that doesn't like Chick-fil-A sauce. You don't like it? I don't like it. Wow. Well, let's turn it off. No, let's just <laughs> shut the off button. <laughs> Wait a minute, but what did you say your favorite was? Because he... Well, what was it? McDonald's, definitely. No, no I meant the dipping ketchup. sauce. Ketchup. Ketchup. Oh, ketchup. Oh, just classic ketchup. ketchup. We're too okay. close to each other. Yeah. I don't like being this close to your face. Huh? <laughs> this is how... Never mind. Nope. Anyway. <laughs> oh. Wait, we said Domino's Pizza Hut or Papa John's. You said Pizza Hut, my guy. He yeah, says... And it's, it's you, not even close. Like, it really isn't. Thank you. I. It's the bread. Something I'm not going to argue. Different. I'm not going to argue. It is. It is. Because Domino's is superior, but I'm not going to argue. I don't that. think so. I think it's... I don't mm. think so. If you're in the YouTube com- comments, please, <laughs> which one do you like? Domino's, Pizza Hut, or Papa John's? And I will just say this. I, I do think the franchise... I was telling Tony this. The one thing that really hurt the franchise is they tried to turn themselves into a restaurant. Yeah. Or started out as a restaurant, pretty much. But they didn't They're know still really... a restaurant. They really didn't know where to go. And I think that hurt them. But at the same time, dude, I will order Pizza Hut over anything any day. Me too. Anyway. Uh, Domino's. Uh, just... And it's really, for me, it's just a pan pizza. Yeah. yeah. That, that's my like, wife. 
I so it's just I said so that much better. Tamaris, I said Jay loves P- Pete's Hut pizza, and she goes, "Well, they do have the pan pizza," and I was like, "They yeah. have the best okay. pan pizza." They do. They do have a yes. good pan pizza. Okay, I'll admit like that. They just, oh. it, the crust is just like so perfect every time. Like, yeah, it's just delicious. It's Dude. soft. It's it's. Are you getting hungry? Because I am. I haven't I'm, eaten. I'm, I'm, I'm about to go order a pizza. <laughs> <Yeah>. <laughs> well, uh, pizza Hut not a sponsor, by the way. Well, so. you could though. I mean, we. Hey, I'll how take you doing? It. Pizza. You would take pizza Hut. if they sponsored, sponsored us. us. Yeah. <laughs> Let's do a pizza commercial. Man. No pizza hut. My, my socials will be below. Right. <laughs> Here's what we're big gonna do. Sin. We're gonna do real fast. Do him first. Uh, we're gonna big sin. You're in this commercial with us. What? And you, I'm gonna talk oh, first. Man. Then Tony's gonna say a line, and you come anything. up with a line at the end. Are you I ready? Have nothing good to say. It's okay. It's okay. No, just man. Sometimes when I get really hungry, <laughs> I can't help but have a slice of pizza from Pizza Hut. The pan pizza is the only good thing I like. Yeah, just order it. <laughs> I don't know. I got nothing. I can't improv, guys. That's what he improv. said. Just order it. It worked better than this anything. Is, yeah, this is uh, not my strong suit. He's he does commercials all the time. I do. I'm an just ad. Oh. For, but you know what's funny? He's like, first of all, pan pizza is the only thing I'll really. Eat. He's like, yeah, I knew it. <laughs> order it. You're hired. <laughs> You're hired, son. You're hired. Gosh, and I went full in. You did. That's you what did was really funny. Did. It deteriorated. It deteriorated. <laughs> it got worse as we went on. Ah, we order the pan pizza. I'm a try hard dude. Yeah. That kind of stuff. <laughs> um, if you haven't done it yet, you might want to. <laughs> God, I love it. Oh, Big Sin, you did great with the lightning round, man. Uh, we appreciate you, dude, for that. Um, dude, we got to know him a lot. He's a veteran, dude. Yeah, and all crazy. these things, awesome. we wouldn't have known that yeah. if we well, did yeah. discover. Right? It's getting to the best part. It is getting to the best part. Welcome, everybody. It's time for trivia. Trivia, trivia, trivia. trivia. And I really hope Big Sin beats Jay. Big Sin. Then I can try. do the next one <laughs> and reclaim my title as being the best. Huh. So much pressure. So much pressure. And listen, we we told Big Sin to to start out. He's not going to take it easy, okay? He's he's a lovable guy. He's obviously lovable. He's this I told him go savage. It's okay. Do it and I'm going to hurt him. Oh, well, jeez. Don't I mean don't hurt, hurt me. Him. I have feelings. Hurt I'm kidding. <laughs> I'm going to do my best. Okay. It depends on what the category is, I guess. The category is video games in general. Just an overall okay. encompassing video game question. And, and how this is okay. going to work, Tony, you have to keep... I'm going to answer one first with the multiple choice, and he's going to answer after me. So right. then, and then he'll answer the first, the next one first. Yeah, we're going to go back and forth, back and forth. Okay. 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 Um, and this is just general video game knowledge, because Big Sin plays everything I've seen. Yeah. And that was the reason I went with Pretty this. Yeah. yeah, I've seen you play Rocket League. I've seen you play Call of Duty. Uh, I've seen you play some old school games, I think. I'll play literally anything. I, I, I get on stream every day and ask them what they want to see, and then I play it. So. That's amazing. Yeah. yeah, we could do that. I mean, I literally have every system except, in every video game. Except, except for Fortnite. Mm. Okay. Fortnite's out. That's okay. If some people don't want to play Fortnite. No, why? I, I'm terrible at it. That's why. Well, so I am build. I. So am I. I can't build. I can't Neither do can it. Neither can I. Like, I st- if you guys we still want to get build dubs. around me while I shoot people. Like I'm in. But. We still get dubs. The only problem is I will say this, Big Sin, and I, and I apply that only for a certain reason. Because if you play Fortnite, you're going to get a lot of people in there that then want you to play it more, right? And or yeah, the other right. people want to play you less. So, but it's still, it's up to you. I get mean, an argument. You, you have a great uh, stream the way it is, dude. So, sorry, I had to stop that just for that question alone. Yeah, no Fortnite. <laughs> oh yeah, that's, that's all right. Okay. 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 So question Trivia. number one. Here we go. Is it my answering first? Or is You're going to answer first, then Big Sin. Okay. okay. What was the first commercially successful video game? Mm-hmm. Pong, Donkey Kong Country, Super Mario Bros., or Shaq Fu? Super Mario Bros. No, you well, get. Sin? Yeah, I said Super Mario Bros. Now, which one do you, you repeat the question for? Him. Oh, uh, what was the first commercially successful video game? Pong, Donkey Kong, Super Mario Bros., or Shaq Fu? I'm going to have to go with Pong. All right. All okay. right. Okay. Okay. We'll go on to the next question. Mm-hmm. So you said Pong. You said Super Mario Bros. So, question no. number two. We've got seven questions, by the way. Okay. What is the best-selling video game of all time? Red Dead Redemption 2, FIFA 18, Minecraft, or Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3? That's Big Sin first. What was the first one? 
The first one was Red Dead Redemption 2. I'm going to have to go with Call of Duty. Call of Duty. Okay. And Jay, the best-selling video game of all time, Red Dead Redemption 2, FIFA 18, mm -hmm. Minecraft, Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 3. I'm going to go with Call of Duty, Modern Warfare 3 as well. All right. That's a tough, that's a tough question. It is a very tough question. It's yeah. tricky. It's tricky. I know. That's Super tricky. <laughs> okay. Question number three. What inspired games maker Satoshi Tajiri to create Pokemon? A dream, butterflies, an old TV show, or his mom? And that's Jay first. Uh, repeat the question, Pat. <laughs> what inspired game maker Satoshi Ta Tajiri? Satoshi. Sorry. To create Pokemon. Mm -hmm. A dream, butterflies, an old TV show, or his mom? A dream. Big I'm going butterflies. Butterflies. Okay. I, I love the way it is. It's just so like, <laughs> All right. <laughs> oh, no. Question number four, I believe. Question number. Yep. Sure. <laughs> All right, question number four. Mm -hmm. What is... The, oh, this is a throw. Uh, what is the armored vehicle in Halo called? Sir Killiton, Basher, Rocksteady, or Warthog? That's Big Sin, I believe. I'm going with Warthog. What, what, what did you say the vehicle was? What is the armored vehicle in Halo called? Sir Killalot, Basher, Rocksteady, or Warthog? Yeah, it's Warthog. I yeah. thought you meant like the tank, but it's the same. So that's that. four. Okay. Question number five, and Jay, you're going to go first on this one. Got it, got it, got it. What was Sonic the Hedgehog's original name? Mm. Fast Blue Hedgehog, Colin the Hedgehog, Mr. Needlemouse, Steven. Can you say the first one again? Fast Blue Hedgehog. It's a Fast Blue Hedgehog. Big Sin. Yeah, I'm going with that too. <laughs> I have no idea. <laughs> I think it's got to be ridiculous, right? It's gotta I mean, be my thoughts is it had to be bad enough for them to change it. So. That, thank you. Yes. We're probably both wrong. But that's, I <laughs> yeah, still love you, bud. Pizza Hut. It's probably Steven. <laughs> I'm, coming into, I'm coming into your chat just saying Pizza so, Hut. That's, that's, there you go. So this is question number six. The UK version mm. of FIFA 2001 were on a, a smell the pitch scratch and sniff disc. True or false? That's big sin. They're weird. I'm going with true. Jay. I, I think just because a lot of our answers have been the same, I'm going to have to go with false. Yeah, All just, right. I kind of think it's true, but I, I'm just going to, you know what I mean? Yeah. I don't want to, yeah. you know, it's got to be. Last question. Ready? Yeah. Yep. Let's do what, it. What is the fictional language in The Sims? Simeon. Simlish. Simile. Cemento. Samento, Samento. Oh, that's Silento. Sorry. Say it again. The fake Sims language. Say the options. Simian, Simlish, Simile, Sim, Cemento. Simian, Simian. Yes. Okay. Final answer. Going with Simlish. All right. All right. Now it's over. Now the time to review <laughs> the answers. <laughs> Question number one. What was the first? Commercially successful video game between Pong, Donkey Kong, Super Mario Bros., and Shaq Fu. Jay said Super Mario Bros., which was incorrect. Big Sin said Pong, which was Dang correct. Dang it, it was the older one. Shoot. That's, yeah, I was going with the first one that I knew. Like, the first, like that's literally the oldest game I know, so. Yeah. yeah. I was first thinking maybe commercially successful. I know it, then. But I remember the me and well, that's, you and you and me. Yeah, that's what I that's, thought. That's Mario 64. Oh, I got the wrong one. So, um... First commercially successful, the reason everybody – it was Pong was because the original first game they, – they claim it as the first game ever made. But there was a game before that that was made, and Pong was the first successful game that actually brought the Atari up. Beep, boop. Okay. Yeah. Beep, there you go. And I, that's Beep, not in my thing. That's just how much knowledge I have. Just knowledge. Nah. Yeah, because I'm good at trivia. <clears throat> he looked it up. So what? what is the best-selling video game of all time? The answers were Red Dead Redemption 2, FIFA 18, Minecraft, or Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. You both said Call of Duty Modern Warfare 3. The actual answer is Minecraft. Gosh, I knew yeah, he was going to be a second I was between. Answer. I was definitely between those two. Yep. 
Minecraft. Minecraft is still selling to this day. Call I'm, of Duty. I'm is finding not. out that Big Sin and I have a lot in common. You really do. <laughs> yeah, we do. We I really have a lot do. in common with. Um... We don't care about okay, that. Yeah. We care about Big Sin. I'm just messing around. <laughs> just kidding. All right. What inspired game maker Satoshi Tajiri to create Pokemon? Oh, we did different ones on Yes, this you did. One. We did. You said uh, Dream, Butterflies, an old TV show, or his mom. You I said, said dream. dream. He said Butterflies. He said Butterflies. Yep. A Dream is wrong. Dang it. Butterflies is right. What? Let's go. He used to catch butterflies. That's and, what I was thinking. That's what yep. I was thinking. He would catch butterflies. Yep. We're, no, we're no longer the same. <laughs> <laughs> okay. Um, Getting your wish. He's going to destroy me. Oh, yeah. He's me. destroying he's you right now. He's going to destroy me. <laughs> um, okay. What is the armored vehicle in Halo called? Warthog. I'm not going to go over there, brother. Yeah. Warthog. You got that right. It. Both of you. Yep. Are you keeping track of the score? With Cortana. That's Cortana. pretty good, right? What was this? What was Sonic the Hedgehog's original name? The blue Sonic. <laughs> Fast blue hedgehog. Colin the hedgehog. Mr. Needle Mouse or Steven. It's the second one, isn't you it? You both said Fast blue hedgehog. And you're both very wrong. It's the Carl. What oh, is it? The, the second one? No, it was Mr. Needle Mouse. <laughs> oh, yeah, I wouldn't have guessed that. Yeah, yeah. I was thinking it was like some bad like English translation. Yeah, or just kind of like keep it to the point. He's a hedgehog yeah. that's blue. No, You're both very wrong. It's cool uh -huh. though. Actually, I think cool. so. Fair he's enough. two, and I got none. Do I have none? No, I have one. I warthog. Three. I have warthog. You have warthog. He has two. I have one. I got three. You have three. He's Sorry, three. my bad. He got pong. Okay. Trying. He got. Pokemon. Yes. He got um, Warthog. 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 Yeah. All I have is Warthog. That's right. Warthog. Nobody got Sonic. Hold All right. Hold on a second. Is there any way we can cheat? Stop. <laughs> UK version Stop. of FIFA 2001. We're on a smell the pitch scratch and sniff disc. True or false? You said true. Yeah. Big Sin said true. I just Jason went with false. false to go. Right. False is wrong. It was true. Dang they it. did put that on a scratch and sniff disc. And it smelled like I think a he got the grass. We should just keep going, but he got the dub. Sounds like that's uh, yeah. yeah. Uh, the last question: uh, What was the fictional language in The Sims? Simian is what you said. Simlish is what he said. Simili, Sim, Simili and uh, Cemento uh -huh. were the other two. You were wrong. Simian's wrong. Dang it. Simlish is correct. What the? Let's go. You just How? got destroyed. What? Yes. Oh man. Total I guess on that one, but. Dude, Big Sin, you did it, dude. I mean, I'm not really that. I mean, he's better than I am, but still, I think Big Sin could have taken you on. He's so good, just just to, because. No, I won't. You, I won't. You need I won't to. accept Let's that see. answer. He always has to win, dude. Everybody, hand claps to to Big Sin, dude. You did. You destroyed me, dude. All I got was the Halo one. That's all. Jay, are you okay? <laughs> It's okay. It's okay. I'm still thinking of Needle Mouse. Just... Mr. Needle. I actually got that when Mr. I took Needle that quiz. Mouse. I got that right because I knew that answer. Okay. You know what? Yep. He's so wow. ignorant. All right. So... I'm actually extremely smart, which is the problem. The so people who think they're really smart are the... No, I'm just kidding. Um, they're really smart. Okay. So, guys, Big Sin, you did it, man. You destroyed... This means next, uh, next podcast, uh, we're going to actually have... Uh, Tony, go against the next streamer. So, dude, you did it. Oh, I don't have to come up with questions. I have no streak now, <laughs> except for in my pants. And I appreciate Ooh. that. Wait a minute. What about pants? I'm sorry. <laughs> too much. Too much information. I didn't okay. hear it, so <laughs> I'm just gonna. No, I'm kidding. Um, that was awesome, man. Uh, you know, congratulations to you. That you did great. I. You got how many? Five out of five. I have. Five he had five. I got all of them. Five out of seven. Wow. Yeah. Good job, man. Good job. Not bad. Dude, great. Um, great. And, Wonderful. Uh, I feel like you threw. I didn't. I was really trying. I was really trying. I feel like he threw. I didn't throw. I'm okay. I'm okay with it. Yeah. There you go. <laughs> Easy dub, man. Just throw myself off a platform. I'm Easy good. dub. No. Um. You know, I mean, you did really great. And I know we're coming to a point here where we're going to be, uh, you know, closing out the podcast. But uh, we really appreciate what you do, uh, Big Sin. And like, you just you keep going, man. It's just like. Uh, you know what you're doing is affecting so many people and gathering people so many communities and and for your stream We're seeing your stream grow more and more and more um, Is there anything we can do to help you like uh, just is there anything that we can do? Let us know. You yeah. know shout out uh, Currently just shout out whoever you want to uh, to promote right now. Yeah, this is your yeah, shout so for, out For you guys, uh, you know, just keep doing what you're doing I, I love what you guys are doing. I love that you guys are going out and finding streamers and helping promote us I, It's huge. It helps a lot more than you probably think hmm. Um, so doing this podcast was something that's super cool. Um, and then I just want to say like to all the other streamers that are listening, you know, if you're just starting, if you're just new, 
don't give up because you literally don't know how close you are to, you know, having an actual following come through. Just three months ago, I was streaming for literally nobody. Um, and then an esports management company came through and offered to sign me to a contract. And here we are today. Wow. So, I mean, just don't give up. Um, so that, that agency is called stream bloom. Um, they've literally changed my streaming career. So, no. um, you know, just wow. don't give up. Don't give up. You just don't know how close you are. You right. know, someone's going to come through and see and believe in your content and you never know. You never know. It's, it's totally true, man. We, uh, you know, I don't know if there's any, uh, any, by the way, if you have no, any other streamers, please DM us big Sen. you know, uh, if you send anybody our way, we'll definitely, you know, automatically, you know, trust and check out their content. And that's something yeah. we do. Uh, and I know you do as well. It's important that we we lurk on a lot of people like with streams. Yeah. We definitely do our homework. Um, you know, Tony and I are like message each other back and forth. We're saying, man, you know, when we were watching for, we found you on TikTok. We actually watched you for a little bit because content is important. And it's like, but not just really content, is. but it's like what you're doing. And it's like, man, you know. Uh, you'd hate to just promote somebody who's just, you, you find out later that right, they're toxic right. or something like that. Right. Or, yeah. Yeah. And we just, and we, we, you know, yeah. again, if you send anybody our way, um, is there, I mean, is there any streamers you want to shout out right now, dude? It's, is there any, anybody? Uh, there's so many, there's so many different streamers in our community. Um, I, I can't do it. <laughs> I can't do it. I'd feel bad leaving somebody out. Um, yeah. But yeah, I mean, it's just, guys, just, you know, if you're listening to this, just have faith in your content, uh, your content. Um, you know, and for me, this was like, I started streaming as a way to give back. Like, that's, that's what I wanted to do. Um, so like one thing we do on our stream, I don't know if you guys know this, but um, $1 from every subscription on my channel gets donated to a charity. Nice. Uh, we change the charity every month. Um, I, I try to always do like some kind of veteran related mental health charity, but right. um, you know, that's, that's something that we do. That's, that's my thing. It's, it's how I give back. So that's um, awesome. Yeah. It's a, really good yeah. Idea. It's a great idea, man. That's, that's really great. And you know, shout out to all your mods too, man. Oh, you man. know, everybody yeah. who helps you out with that too. And uh you and know, your wife and she your does, wife and your yeah. family. Uh, wow. Yeah. You know, it's I mean, great. She's Tell very, us when she starts streaming. We'll, we'll bring her on the show. Yeah. Yeah. She, she, I think she will soon. I mean, she's just so excited right now. I gave her an emote slot on my Twitch. So, I mean, she's I saw like, that on cloud nine and she's just like super excited. She's like, I kind of want to do this now. <laughs> so. so awesome. Um, and again, uh, everybody who's listening to this and or watching this, uh, Big Sin, you, all your links are going to be in the description here uh, okay. on, on the Good. on the yeah. YouTube down here, or if you're on the Spotify or wherever you're at, go ahead and click that as well. It's going to be your Twitch. It's going to be your Discord. Is there anything else? Uh, your we can also put your TikTok in there. Is there anything? Yeah, that's in great. Mm -hmm. um, I have I, I do Twitter as well. If you guys want to do that, oh yeah, we have Twitter. Twitter. Perfect. We I added you. I have a big Recently. following on Twitter, so right. Yeah, <laughs> and we try to have the descriptions right at the top. You know, just so when it's like you can just tell like right before you even drop down the menu, it's right there. Um, so we want to make sure you guys know that. Um, <clears throat> Big Sin, thank you so much for being here, dude. Thank you so much for spending time with us and your busy schedule and what you do. You're awesome, bro. We we really appreciate you. And yeah, um, I seriously appreciate it, guys. I really, really do. And we are, and it's, this is not like a lot of people say this, but we're really here for you. So we're uh, here to support you. We're always in the streams and we're always, you know, if there's anything you need from us, let us know. Yeah. Awesome. Thank you, guys. No problem, man. Uh, well, guys, this has been uh, Overthinking TV uh, interviews streamers, and we talked to Big Sin. So make did it. we did we did it we did it. <laughs> and um, if you guys want again, his links are going to be down below. Please like, comment, subscribe, and if you're on the YouTube, make sure you hit that uh, the bell notification, and also also follow our our, our podcast and Spotify and all our different. We have lots of places to we follow. Do. Us. But most importantly, follow make Big sure Sin. you follow us in real life. Yeah, follow. us around no uh, but most importantly follow big sin and everything he does we'll see you guys next time on overthinking tv interviews streamers <laughs> they do it <laughs>